Hello, folks, and welcome back to Fallout 4. As always, of course, I am Falcon, your host. I look like I'm really wet. My hair is all super shiny. I don't really know why. Maybe because it's raining outside, but I've never noticed any sort of wet effect before. But that does seem to be the case. I don't know. Whatever. You're really aggressively coming over to talk to me. Uh, uh. I'm not sure what? I understand what you're talking about. I find your ignorance awfully convenient. Proctor Quinlan completed the decryption of the data you retrieved from the Institute. A portion of his findings included a list of synths that went missing or escaped from their underground facility. After careful analysis of the information, we've discovered something. Unprecedented. Paladin Dance is a perfect match for one of the synths on that list. Really? That's impossible. That's impossible. I'm afraid not. The evidence is quite damning. The data you brought back included a record of each subject's DNA. We keep the same information on file for all of our soldiers. Paladin Dance's DNA is a perfect match for a synth they called M797. To make matters worse, he's gone AWOL. Disappeared without a trace. His sudden absence hmm. simply reinforces our conclusion that M797 and Paladin Dance are one and the same. I'm finding it difficult to believe that he never confided in you, and then swore you to secrecy. You have to believe- No, he never told me. He never told me he was a synth. <laughs> Apparently, I've misjudged you, which means I've decided to take you at your word. However, that doesn't absolve you of your duty. Dance is a synth. He represents everything we hate. A monstrosity of technology. Our mission in the Commonwealth is clear. The Institute and its creations need to be destroyed in order to preserve our future. Which leaves me facing the most difficult order I've ever given. I'm ordering you to hunt down Dance and execute him. Um... There must be some deserve other some other. Please, you surely must see reason. Absolutely not. My decision is final. Listen, I'm not blind to the fact that Dance was your mentor, and this isn't an easy burden to bear. But if we're to remain strong, we can't afford to make exceptions. Even when it means executing one of our own. Find Proctor Quinlan. He's been analyzing the data and should be able to provide you with a starting point. And Knight, there's a promotion for you riding on the results of these orders. So don't disappoint me. You're dismissed. Uh -huh. Um. All right then. So he's a synth. Interesting. Um. Yeah, we never had any indication of that whatsoever. Attention. And he's. Tomorrow's tactical briefing has been postponed. A new time and date will be forthcoming. Whoever is doing that announcement. Uh, whoever that's supposed to be in the game, I'm pretty sure that is the... Are you a cat? Are you a real cat? Oh, you are. I'm pretty sure that that is a... The voice actor is the guy who plays uh, Tuvok. Commander Tuvok, or Lieutenant Tuvok? Well, whatever the hell rank he is. From uh, Star Wars... Oh, Star Wars. Star Trek Voyager. Uh, pretty sure. Sure as hell sounds like him. Knight, I was told you were coming. Sorry about this business with Dance. Yeah, well, we're not killing Dance, so... <sighs> know about the situation. While I was decrypting all of the data you acquired from within the Institute, I came across a list. It appears that oh, the good. Institute keeps exemplary records where their synths are concerned including logging those that were reported missing. As I was perusing well, yeah. this list, I can't find find an image of Dance under the heading M797. A quick DNA comparison with our own records told the rest of the tale. I'm certain this comes as quite a shock to you, Knight. I'm sorry. 
I don't, uh, want to talk I don't really about want to talk about it. On to your orders, then. I've been poring over Dancer's duty reports, and unfortunately, I haven't found any concrete information. As you're well aware, Dance had intimate knowledge of the Commonwealth, and I'm afraid he could be seeking refuge anywhere. I think our best approach would be to identify every location he's ever visited and eliminate them as possibilities one by one. You may want to get comfortable. This could take quite a bit of... What the hell is this crap about Dance being a synth? I assume your outburst well, is a now. reference to some doubt regarding Dance's identity. I can assure you that my findings are quite accurate, Scribe. So he sets Dance up, and then you knock him down. Is that it? Mm. How did you hear about How'd it? You there hear? are no secrets in the Brotherhood. Maxon's made it clear that we're to locate Paladin Dance, and if we find him, report his location to you. That can only mean you've been sent to hunt him down. Yeah. Uh. Orders are orders. All right, orders. look. Orders, orders are orders. orders. That's all you have to say. I can't believe that after everything Paladin Dance did for you, you're just gonna turn your back on him like this. There's obviously been a mistake, and we need to get to the bottom of it. Scribe Halen, you're addressing a senior officer, and you will show her the respect that she's due. Or so help me, I'll have you brought up on charges. Now, unless you're here with information that can assist us, I suggest you return to the police station immediately. Of course. My apologies, Proctor. I believe I have some information that's relevant to the search. Very well, then. Would you care to enlighten us? Or do we have to wait until you decide to grace us with your knowledge? Knight, if you'd accompany Oof. me to the flight deck, I'd like Oofless. to show you the information I've compiled firsthand. I've stored the data on my Vertiberg gunship's computer. I'll take any. Alright, look, I just want to find him. Finding dance. Yes, ma'am. Proceed, Knight. I'll continue doing my research here. If you'll follow me, ma'am. I'm pretty sure you're trying to get me away from Quinlan. Get us alone before you, uh, are you gonna move? Before you tell me. Can you believe sense? Uh, I have a feeling actually that you know precisely where he is, that this isn't even a matter of I'm gonna show you the data. No, I think you know precisely where he is. I think you are, oh, we'll go to the flight deck so I don't know why it's telling me to go back there because that's not where we're going. We're going to the flight deck. Alright, so presumably she should show up here in a second. I'm actually kind of surprised that she just hasn't walked out. The human looking sense are the worst. They hide in plain sight. Are you actually gonna come out here, woman? Or do I really need to fucking wait for you to walk through the door before me? Oh, are you shitting me, game? Really? Are you really that fucking stupid about it? Attention. All right, dumbass. What are you doing? To the bridge. I don't know. Delta team lead to the bridge. I think she loves. Shit, are you going? Halen, this way. Oh, that is not the flight deck, you idiot. Where the shit are you going? Uh, are are you stupid? This is not where the flight deck is. Scribe Haley, uh -huh. do you actually plan on killing Paladin Dance? Absolutely not. That's, That's a risky question, question, question though. Halen. I know it is, but I need you to listen to me for a minute. I've known Paladin Dance ever since I was an initiate. He trained me, showed me the ropes, and when I screwed up, he taught me to dust myself off and move on. He's earned my admiration, my respect, and my friendship. I don't care what Quinlan's report says. I don't care if he's a machine or not. He still dance. Precisely why I have no intention of... That's a bold that statement. That is a bold it's statement. It's more than just a statement. It's a plea. Dance is the most selfless person I've ever met. I've watched him risk his own life based on nothing more than principle alone. 
That's why I'm asking you. Not just as a member of the Brotherhood, but as a human being. Give him a chance. Let him tell his side of the story. If you're not convinced by what he says, or somehow he's become truly lost to us, then you do what you have to do. Is not compassion a worthy virtue? Yeah, yeah, Carrie. We have no intention of killing him. All right. I'll hear uh, him. Yeah. That's all that I ask. I'll just have to trust that when the time comes, you'll do the right thing. <clears throat> Before the Pribwin showed up, Dance had me identify a fallback point if we ever lost the police station. It was listening post Bravo, an old pre-war U.S. military outpost on the northern frontier of the Commonwealth. It's isolated, and we're the only ones that knew about it. So, there's a good chance that's where he's headed. Just be careful. There's no telling what state of mind he's in right now, or if he trusts any of us at all. Probably doesn't, but that's fine because I have no intention of killing him, so you don't have to worry, darling. Dance will not be killed under any circumstances. I'm gonna travel to Green Top. Oh, I can't travel here. Oops, yeah, there. We'll travel to Green Top and then I'll go from there to. Um, We'll walk over it from there, because I don't want to just fast travel to the place, because I'm afraid that we'll fast travel on top of something that we may not want to necessarily... I would argue with you people, but you're too stupid to argue with, so... See, this is my problem with the Brotherhood. This is why... I'm not really a big fan of the Brotherhood at times, because they are so extreme in their dislike of anything that doesn't fit their worldview. Now, there's been times when the Brotherhood wasn't like this. The Brotherhood in Fallout 3, which is the same group here, by the way, was different. That's because the leader was different. Their leader was a more tolerant, uh, generous individual than Maxon is. Maxon is an extremist who is very, very strict and, uh, unbending in his, oh hi, do oh, fuck with me turrets, it'll go very poorly for you. So fucking what the shit was that? Where the fuck did you come from? No, you ain't dead. Where'd you go, bitch? Like I said, I know you're not dead. You had a fucking missile launcher on you? That's hilarious. Also kind of scary, but... Hilarious. Alright, Dots, where are you? See, I've been here before. We couldn't get into this place previously. Apparently we can now. Going down. Apparently we can get into it now, even though we couldn't before. Sup, Curie? The power armor does look so badass. You know, having her on is actually not necessarily a good idea. Oh, Jesus. Fuck you. This, this, this weapon does way more damage against, uh... This weapon does way more damage against, uh, enemies. Robot enemies than the, uh, things we were using before. 
than the laser does. Way more damage. We're not talking like slightly more damage either. No, no, no. It is a very significant jump in firepower. He's not in his power armor anymore. That's interesting. Very interesting. Ooh, grapes. That's actually a good one because that is one of these special ones that does something else other than just whatever the basic stuff does. Is that Death Claw? No, it's a Brahmin Skull. Why do I have a feeling this is like a Death Claw hideout or something? Oh. I'm not surprised. Max. Possibly. He never liked to do the dirty work himself. Of course not. He's a coward. Why didn't, Why you, didn't tell you tell me? me? Because I didn't know. Until Quinlan got that list decoded, I thought synths were the enemy. I never expected to hear that I was one of them. If it wasn't for Halen, we wouldn't even be having this conversation. So, what are your orders? Does Maxon even want me alive? No. No, but I'm hoping there's a way out. Don't be ridiculous. Look, I'm not blind to the fact that we're good friends, and this must be very difficult for you. I wish Maxon had sent someone else, but that doesn't change a thing. I'm a synth, which means I need to be destroyed. If you disobey your orders, you're not only betraying Maxon, you're betraying the Brotherhood of Steel and everything it stands for. Synths can't be trusted. Machines were never meant to make their own decisions. They need to be controlled. Technology that's run amok is what brought the entire world to its knees and humanity to the brink of extinction. I need to be the example, not the exception. I highly, totally disagree. If you really but if that's the case, why did you run? Why did you run in the first place? The moment I learned the truth, I knew my life was in danger. I'm a soldier. So self-preservation kicked in. I needed to regroup and assess the situation. Once I got here, and I had some time to think, I realized I'd just made everything worse. I should have stayed on the Pridwin and accepted the inevitable. Like I said, I need to be the example, not the exception. The mm -mm. That you're, you're human, dude. Me, it's a human emotion. I appreciate what you're trying to do. But I've made my decision. I'm ready to accept. Well, that's the bloody unfortunate of my because true identity. Maxon's ordered you to execute me, and I'll be damned if I'm going to stand in your way. Well, I'm just no. not doing it. So I won't do it, Dance. I can't believe you'd risk your life just to keep me alive. Why would you do that for me? You're the because he's that just fucking wrong. wrong. You're a synth, but everything you've done has been for the good of mankind. You're right. How could I have been so blind? I'm not technology that's gone out of control. I've been a benefit to mankind, not its downfall. Perhaps now that you've opened my eyes, I can consider my next move. Whatever you uh, say. Yeah, I've to got do, your back there, dude. I've got your back. Thank you, my friend. But I have my own path to follow. The only no, good choice is for me to leave the Commonwealth. The sooner no, I make no. the border, the sooner I put this behind me. Take my holotags. Use them to prove that your mission was a success, or Maxim will just send someone else to hunt me down. Now, come on. Let's get the hell out of here. Well, you're you are you are not uh you're not leaving, dude. Just saying. You ain't leaving. Oh, another tentacle document. Goody. Military grade circuit board. Just what I don't actually need. More Mentat grapes. Nice. Okay. Uh, what, what the hell did you go? Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Knowing 
Oh. Well then. Yeah, see, that's, that's further proof that this is merely a loading screen. He didn't actually walk in, he just disappeared like he would if it had been a doorway. Because as far as the game is concerned, it is a doorway. This took entirely longer than I was expecting. Okay, so quick save. How dare you betray the Hi there! It's not her fault, it's mine. I'll deal with you in a moment. Knight, why has this this thing not been destroyed? He's still alive you're wrong. because you're wrong about him. Him! Dance isn't a man. It's a machine. An automaton created by the Institute. It wasn't born from the womb of a loving mother. It was grown within the cold confines of a laboratory. Flesh is flesh. Machine is machine. The two were never meant to intertwine. By attempting to play God, the Institute has taken the sanctity of human life and corrupted it beyond measure. After all I've done for the Brotherhood. All the blood I've spilled in our name. How can you say that about You're me? the physical embodiment of what we hate most. Technology that's gone too far. Look around you, Dance. Look at the scorched earth and the bones that litter the wasteland. Millions, perhaps even billions, died because science outpaced man's restraint. They called it a new frontier and pushing the envelope, completely disregarding the repercussions. Can't you see the same thing is happening again? You're a single bomb in an arsenal of thousands, preparing to lay waste to what's left of mankind. <laughs> Seriously? You're comparing dance to a nuclear bomb. This machine might not be a bomb, but its goal is exactly the same. Place it where you want the damage done. And when sure, you least expect it, it delivers a lethal blow without warning and without mercy. A precision strike delivered right at the heart of the enemy. How can you trust the word of a machine that thinks it's alive? A machine that's had its mind erased, its thoughts programmed, its very soul manufactured. Those ethics that it's striving to champion aren't even its own. They were artificially inserted in an attempt to have it blend into society. It's true. I was built within the confines of a laboratory, and some of my memories aren't my own. But when I saw my brothers dying at my feet, I felt sorrow. When I defeated an enemy of the Brotherhood, I felt pride. And when I heard your speech about saving the Commonwealth, I felt hope. Don't you understand? I thought I was human, Arthur. From the moment I was taken in by the Brotherhood, I've done absolutely nothing to betray your trust, and I never will. It's too late for that now. The Institute has foolishly chosen to grant you life. You simply should not exist. I don't intend to debate this any longer. My orders stand. It's all right. We did our best. You convinced me that I was wrong to be ashamed of my true identity, and I thank you for it. Whatever you decide, know that I'm going to my grave with no anger, and no regrets. Touching. Either you execute dance, or I will, Knight. The choice is yours. That's extremely dangerous. Because I might have to annihilate you if you do. After all, all right, the listen sacrifices to me. I've made, and all the battles I've fought for the Brotherhood, you need to listen to me. You owe me that much. Very well. I'm listening. You'll lose us both. Whether he's right, human or not, Dance saved the lives of countless Brotherhood soldiers. Now it's time you saved his. You're a stubborn woman. So, it appears we've arrived at an impasse. Allowing Dance to live undermines everything the Brotherhood stands for. Yet you insist that he remains alive, which leaves me with only a single alternative. Dance... As far as I'm concerned, you're dead. You were pursued and slain by this Brotherhood Knight. And your remains were incinerated. From this day forward, you are forbidden to set foot on the Pridwin or speak to anyone from the Brotherhood of Steel. Should you choose to ignore me, know you'll be fired upon immediately. Do we understand each other? I do. Thank you for believing in me, Arthur. 
Don't mistake my mercy for acceptance. The only reason you're still alive is because of her. I'm returning to the Pridwin Knight. Take some time. Say your goodbyes. And then I expect to see you there. We still have the Institute to deal with. Indeed. Oh, Kiri idolizes me. Again, it's the second time that she's reached that point. Excuse me. It took a hell of a lot of guts to stand up to Maxon like that. At least we know he isn't chasing stay. you anymore. If you stay here, you should be safe. That's an excellent suggestion. I didn't plan on spending the rest of my days at this old listening post. But it will have to do. Besides, you're still going to need my help. And I'll be damned if I'm going to let you wander the Commonwealth alone. Now, you better get back to the Pridwin. In the meantime, I'll start making this bunker more livable. If you ever need me, I'll be right here. What about Halen? Uh, what about Halen? Jackson knew she was involved, so she'll be safe. I'll contact her and let her know what happened here. It's the least I could do. Are you going to have a problem killing synths? I might physically be a synth, but my heart and mind belong to the Brotherhood. The Institute is still a tremendous threat to the Commonwealth. They possess technologies that need to be confiscated or destroyed. I promise you, I won't hesitate to pull the trigger on them. Can't you come with well, me? Well, come now? with me. You heard what Maxon said. If I'm seen aboard the Pridwin, at the police station, or at the airport, not only would I be killed, I'd undermine his authority. I won't do that. But if you need me to take the fight anywhere else, I'll be there. Goodbye, Dance. All right, well, bye for now. I hope the next time we meet, it will be on. I must, I must. Uh, oh, oh, hold, hold on on that. Oh, that sounds what's, what's good. Up? It is much better than that. I beg to become a synth for a reason. For science, to be able to make real progress in studying the medical arts, I have had a breakthrough. Using a new strain uh -huh. of mute fruit, I have discovered a way to greatly improve the restorative properties of steam packs. I realize this is not earth shaking, but it means that inspiration does exist. <laughs> cool. I know it wasn't easy, but you did it. I find my head full of notions. Experiments. Many will fail, but maybe I will make more discoveries. And you have given me this capacity. And beyond that, so much more. The world is full of life, possibilities. You are very dear to me, my close friend. And I hope I can return the many favors you have given me. Well, it's good. Uh, the love yeah. between us is deeper than friendship. My very first thought in all this excitement was, I must tell you, it wouldn't feel real until I shared it with you. You know, you mean very much. Oh, I am so terrible at this. It's okay. You mean a lot to me, too. I dare not hope. When we are apart, I guess and second guess. I should be only thinking about this achievement. Instead, my thoughts, they linger on you. Oh, how cute. I love uh, you, so, yeah. and I love you. Yay, combat medic, yes, which gives me what? And I cannot wait to see what becomes of this. Cool. Uh, combat medic. That is, um, this day you heal 100 points if your health falls below 10%. Oh, so if you get hurt beyond a, a certain point, you just automatically get your health back. Uh, to a degree, anyway. Cool. Uh, did Dance go down inside the place? I guess he did. Uh, I want to talk to him because I want to get his perk and I believe uh, when I was looking up the perks and stuff and how to get them um, I believe that in order to get his perk you had to go through this quest first and once you've done so 
I think it unlocks the ability to get his perk. In order to do that, however, we need him You're making to proud. talk to us, which apparently he won't do. Apparently he won't do until I uh, go back and talk to uh, Maxim again. Damn it. That's kind of annoying, but whatever. That's fine. Well, we have Kiri's thing, which is what I was trying to get all this time. That's why I had her along with me. Uh, she was pretty easy to actually get the uh, her perk. Like, I didn't really have to do a whole hell of a lot. She just, she likes you very much to begin with, and you don't really have to work too hard to get it, to get her to, uh, don't really have to do a whole hell of a lot to get her to, uh, go along with you. Okay, oh yeah, see, I have to complete the blind betrayal quest before I can, uh, uh, talk to uh, Don to get him to join me. So all I have to do is go back to uh, back to here, talk to Maxim, uh, complete the quest completely, and then um, Don should talk to me, and it should be possible to get him as our companion again. And it should give him, or he should immediately give me the perk. Because uh, he should be pretty much maxed out already. I had a. Uh, Reporting is ordered, Elder. Before we continue. Well, on everything, really. I want to make one thing clear. This conversation will be the last time we speak about Dance. As far as the Brotherhood of Steel is concerned, he's dead. Do you understand? Sure, sure. I'll never understand, but understood. Good. Fine. Of course, Dance's execution creates a missing link in our chain of command. That traitor held quite an important position with us. I'm certain that you'll make a fine replacement. His quarters and all his possessions are now yours, including his personal suit of power armor. Congratulations, Paladin. Uh, yeah. Had I even a single doubt in my mind, I wouldn't have awarded you the promotion. Just be aware that a Brotherhood Paladin is expected to be a symbol of integrity to our brothers and sisters. I trust you won't disappoint them or disappoint me. In any event, we still have the Institute to contend with and a lot of work to do before we can begin our final assault. While the finishing touches are being put on the Liberty Prime, Captain Kells has identified a potential threat to our operations. Report to him immediately for your next assignment. Ad Victorium, Paladin. Ah, fuck. That quest that he just gave me. The one that's the next quest here is... The one that's gonna be a problem. Uh, because we have to destroy the railroad for it. Which I don't want to do, so. Um. Yeah, that's a problem. Ah, Paladin. I don't even know, do I? I don't even know that I want to, uh. Come back here now, Paladin. This briefing isn't over. Uh, no. I'm not going back there. Sorry. In fact, I'm leaving. <laughs> Completely leaving. Oh, this is not even where I wanted to go. Damn it. Anyway, folks, uh, thanks for watching. Ooh, excuse me, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. Uh, next time, Attention we're going to do a little bit of a... Soldiers. If you have not yet received your Squire Mentorship assignment, please come see me on the bridge. Your promotion was well deserved. Repeat, if you have not received your Mentorship assignment, please report to the bridge. That is all. Uh... Was this it? I think this one was his power armor. I think. Yeah, yeah. This is Dance's power armor here. Or what used to be his power armor. 
Uh, let's pull the fusion core, the 100% core out of it, and put in the uh, our old kind of rough core. And I'm, I'm going to jump in the armor because I'm going to take it out of here, and I'm going to stick it. Uh huh. Um. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I will take this out of here, and I'm going to leave it back up at base. Actually, I might just give it back to Dance. <laughs> I might be like Dance. You get in this power armor. And he'll be like, okay, cool. And I'll be like, there you go, you're back where you belong. <laughs> Got your armor back. Uh, in fact, let's go do that real quick. Let's go talk to him super fast before we uh, you're looking for medical do anything else. Um, it is possible that the quest has been bugged and screwed up a little bit. Um, or that his affinity, I should say, has been bugged and screwed up a little bit. Because apparently... There's a chance after you complete the quest that it actually resets his affinity as opposed to keeping it where it should be, which should have been, you know, pretty much at maximum. So we'll have to talk to him and see if it uh, see if it works or not. It might. It might not. Guess we will find out in a second. Uh, so we'll go down. We'll go talk to to him real quick. And then, um, see if he'll join me, and then see if he gives me the, if he'll talk to me, and see if he'll give me the, uh, well, hi. What the, the fuck? Oh, oh, what? Wait, 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 what? Why are you in power armor kids? Ready to continue our mission, soldier? Ready. Roger. What? Oh, it is Monsieur Dance. Well, they so sure. Sharing technological information isn't permitted. However, if you wish to donate. Okay, so we're going to send you to Sanctuary. If you have a moment, I have. Because I'm a little confused. Uh -huh. Go ahead. It is important, but I don't. You want to just say? Uh, okay. Hold on. I need to go turn off that fucking radio. Because for whatever reason, you've apparently decided to Remember, screw me with playing music. But we're not representing the Brotherhood, you idiot. We're not part of the Brotherhood anymore. Well, you're not, anyway. I am, I suppose, but you're not. Well, you you did move in. You did move in. You do have quite a bit of stuff here. Need something? Did you have? All right. So, what did you want? Personal matter I mentioned. Yeah. Sounds important. What do you want? It is important, but. Uh. Well. Um, let's start from the beginning. Take a deep breath and start from the beginning. <sighs> I'll try. I've spent my do that. entire life, or at least what I perceive as my life, following a plan to shape my own future. But since my banishment, uh -huh. I feel lost. Almost like I exist without purpose. For the first time since that moment I signed up with the Brotherhood, I don't have all the answers. I don't have a plan, and it scares the hell out of me. You know, it's it is kind of impossible to plan at times. Hell, I didn't expect to wake up 200 years in the future. Yet you've been able to roll with every punch that's been thrown at you. Don't you understand? Everything I had, everything I knew is gone. In the span of a few hours, my identity was ripped from me and my world turned upside down. At least what you had was something tangible, something real. Your husband, your son. They were living, breathing humans who loved you and cared for you. Those sons of bitches who created me couldn't even be bothered to implant memories of having siblings or parents. 
I don't even know how much of my own past is artificial and how much is real. Can you even imagine that? I started out as nothing, and I've ended up as nothing, and I don't know what the hell to do about it. Hey, well, you need to fight. You need to fight this thing. I'm not giving up. Not yet. I suppose you're right. Maybe I'm just missing the point. My life's starting over. And I need to come to terms with everything I've lost and everything I've gained, which includes something important you've made me realize. I don't know if it's friendship or an anomaly in my programming. After all, I'm not really human. But whatever it is, I can't deny that I'm feeling closer to you than anyone else I've ever met. I'm flattered that yeah, you can help me with your feelings like this. Thank you. You're welcome. If anyone deserves to know how I really feel, it's you. Look, I know that this has been difficult for you. In fact, I don't envy some of the recent decisions you've had to make. If our roles had been reversed, I'm not so sure I could have handled it as well as you did. Whatever the case may be, I just want to thank you for sticking by me and remind you that what I said before still stands. If you need me, I'll be here for you. Cool. And gain the Know Your Enemy perk, which is one of the best perks in the game. In fact, it pretty much is the best perk in the game that you can get for your allies. Um, there we go. Because uh, you do 20% more damage against ghouls, mutants, and synths. So a good chunk of the most common and toughest enemies that you run across in the entire game, you do a good deal more damage to. Uh, so very... Very useful. Dance, I'm going to have you follow me, and I'm going to leave you at Sanctuary. Um, I'm going to do that off-camera, though, so thanks for watching, folks. Like and subscribe if you enjoy my stuff. Are you following me, dude? Yeah, there we go. And I will see you all later. Take it easy, have a good day, and thank you for watching. As always, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye, folks.